Hello, and welcome to the Old God's Meadery, where I make meat for myself. Because today's meat is going to be so disgusting, nobody's going to want to be friends with me. Today we make Kopi Lilik mead. Why? Well, it's the Palm Civet's favorite mead, and the Palm Civet doesn't take your shit. Because I took his. Real quick, if you haven't heard of the Kopi Lilik mead, K-O-P-I-L-U-W-A-K. Look it up and then come back and judge me the rest of the video. Let's start by dumping these Kopei Luik coffee beans into the bucket. I mean, it smells like coffee. Ew, I touched one. Half gallon of water to that. That doesn't look too shitty. All right, let's start with your 60 pound bucket of honey. We're gonna need three pounds of that today. Close enough. Add your other half gallon of water to that. Heat and stir, but not too hot. Yesterday's Mexican food, too hot. Your poop should be just body temperature. All right, combine the two. Ah. Add in your yeast. Add the yeast. About a half teaspoon of yeast nutrient. Seal her up. Now shake that thing like you're shaking your head at me right now. A giant maraca. All right, airlock. A dab of water. And we're done. Now we wait. All right, it's been about two weeks and we've officially stopped bubbling. Just like that incident you had in the Taco Bell bathroom. Let's siphon this goodness into the carboy. I'm starting to think this is a bad idea. Just like two girls, one cup, this part sucks. We'll do our best to leave all that gunk at the bottom. That's dead yeast, y'all. And dead poop. If I had to see it, so did you. Airlock it again, and we're going to place it in a cool, dark place. You can make your own poop jokes from here on out. And then we wait for clarification from the mead, not your jokes.
Now that's the same color as the pretty size you ever seen, isn't it? Let's bottle this mead. This part sucks times four. Just like every hour you suffer through your diarrhea. Probably after drinking this. Four bottles, corked, labeled, batch 45 is complete. Thank you so much for watching batch 45. It all led to this. So, in between takes, I do the dishes and wash things. The entire house smells like coffee. I don't think it's going to go away. So, this has a very, very strong, it, it, it smells more like coffee than coffee smells like coffee. I, I don't know why. It smells like coffee. And it better for how expensive this coffee is. I'm so nervous. Well, it's pretty color. It's like a very light brown, a little bit darker than a typical mead. <sighs> okay, let's do it. So it tastes like a sweet mead and then you get this coffee. It tastes like coffee afterwards. I don't taste any poop. But it's weird that the coffee beans went through a digestive system and then the yeast ate it and now it's going through my di digestive system. Skull. Probably won't make it again.